One of the key steps in unraveling the mystery of hydrogen bonds and protein structure involved this man, Linus Pauling, a cold and a Nobel Prize. Then they asked themselves a fundamental question. We asked, uh, how is the polypeptide chain folded? Then one day he had a crucial insight in a completely different and unexpected setting. I had a cold. I was lying in bed for two or three days, and I read detective stories, light reading, and for a while, and then I got sort of bored with that, so I said to my wife, bring me a sheet of paper, and I'm going to, I think I'll work on that problem of how polypeptide chains are folded in proteins. So she brought me a sheet of paper and a slide rule and a pencil, and I started working. Using the knowledge gained from his years of model building, he drew the backbone of a polypeptide chain on a piece of paper. Then it occurred to him to try to fold the paper to see how hydrogen bonds could form along the polypeptide chain. The result was a structure that twisted around like a spring. Well, uh, I succeeded. It only took a couple of hours of work that day in March of 1948 for me to find the structure called the alpha helix. Pauling's insight was a huge stride towards understanding the structure of proteins and the role of hydrogen bonds in the second level of protein structure. For this work, he was awarded the Nobel Prize in 1954.